In this video, we take you on a tour of everything to do around Staniel Key. This season of Sailing Doodles features Taylor and Bobby as we set sail for the Caribbean with our two Labradoodles, Maverick and Goose. If you're enjoying the videos, we invite you to click subscribe. It's an easy way to support our channel. It's the patrons that make this channel possible. We thank you so much. All right, so we have a big day planned today. We are gonna take the dinghy all over the place, do lots of snorkeling, swimming with sharks, all that stuff. And uh, we have a couple guests here today. Really happy to have Ron with Precision Sales. Morning. He uh, brought us some spare parts, thank you. Um, he <laughs> muled us some uh, boat parts and filters and everything. Right on. So it, uh, yeah. and, and he also, y'all got us, y'all hooked us up with the sales, so yeah. thanks for doing that. Yeah. And we have our friend and patron over here, Michelle. She's gonna hang out for us for, for the few days as well. All right, well, you excited about doing some snorkeling and swimming sharks today? Okay, well, let me grab Taylor, see what she's doing, and let's get out of here. We had a busy day fitting in everything we could around Staniel Key, beginning at Pig Beach, Thunderball Grotto, and then heading up to Rachel's Bubble Bath before hitting the aquarium for some snorkeling, back down to Rocky Dundas, and ending up at Compass Key. All right, the first place we're going to is Pig Beach. The pigs are already on the beach. Uh, it's right there. Do that, and then it's high tide. We'll go to uh, uh, Thunderball Grotto, slack tide, and then head north up to Rocky Dundas, uh, the aquarium, all these other places up there. Everything's within about five or six miles, and that's why it's nice having a 20 horsepower dinghy. Is that you know we can do it's six or seven miles. It'll only take us 10 minutes, 15 minutes to get up there. You know, well, maybe half an hour. <laughs> We were anchored only a few hundred yards away from Pig Beach. It was fun having the pigs swim right up to us in our dinghy. Although the pigs did get a little aggressive for the food. He's gonna get you. He likes it when you run. Oh, hello. Over the past few years, the pigs' lives has improved greatly with good shelter and fresh water. It's so cute. The baby one's my favorite. That guy is, that guy is huge. It's a big boy. We even got lucky enough to see the little babies. All right, we got this done just in time for like four tur tourist boats to show up. So heading out Thunderball Grotto. We did that the other day, but they haven't done it, so we'll do it real quick. Thunderball Grotto is a hollowed out center of an island with skylights. It's where they filmed the James Bond movie, Thunderball. If you'd like a more in-depth view, you can take a look at our previous video. By the time we were ready to leave, the place was absolutely packed. This is like the busiest time of the year for Staniel Key, so I mean, try not to do it <laughs> during Christmas break. All right guys, what you think? Oh, it's cool. Yeah. Our next stop was a place known as Rachel's Bubble Bath. So this is called Rachel's Bubble Bath. The uh, waves break over this little cliff and there's a pool that fills up with uh, the froth from the bubbles. The tide's going out, so we don't want to risk taking the dinghy all the way down there and then get stuck, so we're leaving it there. Oh, 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 oh,
is Rachel's Bubba Bath definitely worth a visit? That was awesome. They say it's better at high tide and it's just after high tide. Well, we got here about 45 minutes an hour after high tide, so that's perfect. Um, Cause you still want it to be high enough for the waves to come over. Pretty cool though. And they say it's better if it's a little, you know, at least there's some swell out there. It was like perfect day for it. Yeah, perfect, it was great. Now we are gonna go ahead to the, the fishes. Yeah, the aquarium is a snorkel spot where they call it the aquarium because the water is just super clear and there's like a million fish. So we'll go check it out. This area is called the aquarium. Uh, they got a little mooring ball tied up to it. Hopefully you don't drift into the rocks. And apparently it's like super clear and really good fish. The current can be really strong once you cleared the safety of the aquarium, so you had to be careful. I can see why they call it the aquarium. It felt like we were actually swimming inside one. So you can see why they call it the aquarium. It's pretty cool. Uh, you might, it's a lot of current coming through here though. So you might want to do it at slack tide. This is Rocky Dundas. It's a, uh, another grotto apparently you swim under. You can kind of see it right there, yeah. So we'll swim under, it's another grotto like Thunderball Grotto with a, a hole in the middle. We'll do it. Y'all ready? Yeah. Let's go. It was really cool because it strangely looked like a cathedral in there, but it was really nice to be able to have the place all to ourselves. Alright, a cool spot here, Rocky Dungeons. Way less people than Thunderball, which nope. is nice. Uh, we're gonna head now to Compass Key to go swim with some nurse sharks. Whee! This is Compass Key, you got the sharks there. We'll get in with those in a little bit. Uh, they charge $10 a person, like a landing fee. Uh, and then you know, we'll buy some beers and hopefully they have a burger or two here. But we'll check it out. You ready? Go swim with sharks? Yeah. Have you ever been destroyed waiting for that call? Growing sick within your heart, but it never shows. Have you ever felt defeated? Cause you can't move on just like she has. You're falling down and not for heart. You can't turn it off. It's a definite must-see spot for cruisers and the Exumas. Okay, don't bite me, you bastard. Get him. Okay. Get him. Bite him right in the nuts. Bite him right in the nuts. 
stop. Okay. You know what I mean? Oh my god, this thing is huge! He's gonna get you. He likes it when you run. Oh, hello. That's long. Look how long that thing is been He's getting him. Go get him. Right, that's all I got. That is a long pee. Ew.